To remove the wireless LAN antennas, first remove the access panel, the front bezel, and the drives cage. Carefully snap off the antennas from the wireless LAN board. Remove the rear antenna from the small cable tunnel next to the motherboard. Remove the rear antenna cable from the cable guide on the inside rear wall of the PC. Squeeze the bottom side tabs of the rear antenna cover to release the bottom of the cover and pull the cover off of the unit. Detach the Phillips number one screw for the rear antenna. Pry the antenna off of the rear of the unit and pull its cable out the rear of the unit. Remove the front antenna from its cable guides on the front EMI bracket. Pull the front antenna cable out to the front of the unit through its access hole. Detach the Phillips number one screw for the front antenna and pry the front antenna off of the unit. Each antenna has a small hole that fits over a small locator peg on the front or rear of the PC. To replace the front antenna, align the hole on the antenna over its alignment peg and press the antenna adhesive onto the chassis. Secure the front antenna with its Phillips number one screw. Pass the front antenna cable back into the unit through its access hole. Route the front antenna cable back into the cable guides on the front EMI bracket. Feed the rear antenna in through its access hole at the rear of the unit. Align its hole over its peg and press onto the chassis. Secure the rear antenna with its Phillips number one screw. The rear antenna cover has two small hooked tabs on the bottom sides and two tabs on the top sides that fit into slots on the rear of the unit. To replace the cover, insert the two top tabs into their slots, then press the bottom of the cover until the bottom tabs have snapped into place. Replace the rear antenna into the cable guide on the rear inside wall of the PC. Align the rear antenna cable into the small cable tunnel next to the motherboard. Replace the antennas to the wireless LAN board. The antenna connectors are labeled 1 and 2 and should be connected to the corresponding 1 and 2 labeled ports on the wireless LAN board.